Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. In this episode, well, last little episode, we made it into the Zuta Ruins. Zuta Ruins. Oh, and I mispronounced that thing. That's supposed to be Adogu. D-O-G-U. I looked it up. Don't really know what it is, but... There it is, and that's how you spell it. But, uh, yeah, anyway, we ha we fished with Kokari. Um, fished up some really big salmons. Fishing up. And we got a key that came out of the salmon that led us into this... Our first real dungeon of the game. That I could call. I guess I could call that. And we found this really weird-looking wall. Let's examine it. What's up with this white wall? It looks pretty solid. We're not getting any further. I mean, I don't think even you... You could do something about this. Let's find another way in for now. Hmm. Mysterious giant wall blocks? How strange. We'll just have oh we'll just have to deal with that later. Got to headbutt it, but probably not gonna do anything like Ishan said. Ooh, what's in here? Oh, I want the treasure chest. What is it? Enhancing divinity. Scroll drum my wiring, blah blah, blah blah, artist, blah blah, contains useful blah blah information, blah blah. Praise is earned by restoring nature and feeding animals. Praise can then be used to power up your divine attributes. Your solar energy, ink pot, astral pouch, and purse can be powered up. Power up wisely to prepare for the difficult adventure that awaits. You said it. Hmm. Okay, let's um Oh no! I don't know what was going on with that. My controller's moving really fast or something, or maybe I'm just not noticing it. Traveler's Charm. Protects travelers from danger, increases godhood by level 1. I haven't actually even used a Traveler's Charm. Oh no! Oh, you mean face. I didn't even see you there. You're trying to hurt me, mean tree. I'm trying to talk to my nice viewer people. Goodness, I'm not gonna cut you down though, like I did the tree in, um, Hana Valley. That was a complete accident, by the way. Ooh, Steel Soul Saki. I wanna talk about this. Saki brewed the Spirit of Seal. Steel. Temporarily increases defense. This is like your defense plus one item of the game. You drink it, you get super strong defenseness. I mean, like, it's like your defense one up potion of great. I guess. There's another one, I think, that gives you more attack. But I'm not sure. Oh, whoa, hello there, tree. <laughs> You're getting rather close. I'll throw it. No, throw it. Thank you. Chop. Plop. Zop. I don't know. Had to rhyme. Blop, blop, blop. Oh, I didn't do blop, blop, blops for the other tree, so I'm going to go blop, blop, blop right now. Oh, you thought you would... Uh, you thought I wouldn't see you? I saw you! Yeah! Yeah! Uh-huh. <sighs> Yay. I don't care anymore. Um, let's just zoom over here. Blah, 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 by the way. Um, let's zoom over here. Wilted Clover. Give it a circle. Oh, it's all nice again. We got five praise. Blah, 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 blah. Um, let's see. Let's go through here now. Ooh, this place is rather green and mossy. Hmm. Mysterious. Ooh, a bud. What treasures will it hold? Incense burner. We've already gotten one of these. But coolness. Aw, uh, can I climb up the wall, please? Thank you. Okay. Let's see. What's in here? Oh, there's a cutscene in here. That's what's in here. Um, it's showing us up there. There must be something important up there. Of importance. Oh, but wait. There's a tricky important thing back here. I was smart and I double checked. Okay, camera angle. You are my friend and I am not going to yell at you today. Um, but yeah, there's a tricky thing back here. Okay, there's a tricky thing back here that I'm trying to show the nice people. Can I show it? Thank you. Yeah, you can get back, you can get up on here and, can I have my stuff that was in the pot? I don't care. Um, you can get on here and looky here, back here, wilted clover of secret. 
And you can actually dig up this rock. It's not mean rock. It's just nice rock. This is the nice rock. Blah, 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 blah. Yay. But anyway, let's go back up here. Um, take a nice run up here. Jump up here. Wee. Um, what's over here? I see lots of water. The head of like one of those statues with lots of water pouring on top of it. That's actually pretty. I love this game's graphics. It's just amazing. Oh, let's circle there. Jump there. Jump here. Um, what's up here now? Ooh, ooh. Um, there's a there's a rock that looks like the um orb of grow trees. Oh, here's the steel fist Saki, the other Saki I was talking about. Saki brewed with the spirit of steel. Steel temporarily increases attack power. That's like the exact opposite of like steel soul. It Saki, it just does stuff. What's up with this round stone? It's much heavier than it looks. It doesn't look like it'll budge no matter how you push or pull. Wow, it's not going anywhere. Uh I'm sorry, I was just, I was talking about that and how it sort of looks like the, um, the growing thing, but, uh, then I saw this bud down here. And that bud's moving. And it's a darker color than all the other buds. And it's rather large. And a little pointy looking. Maybe if I approach it cautiously, oh no. Crap. Oh, what? Oh, no! No way! Bud's gone madness! Oh my goodness, this is the Bud Ogre. Okay. You cannot hurt these guys. Unless you do something special. Like, they'll poop out one of those seeds. Oh, you, you're not supposed to miss the seed. You're supposed to slash the seed, and it'll hit them. And they'll fall down, and it will tell you to circle them. You gotta bloom them. Okay, now look for a chance to use your celestial brush. Still this thing, sure, got a tough bud. Wonder if you could open its bud before you attacked it. Yeah, we're gonna open this thing. And when you open it up, there's a thing inside. And we're just gonna get rid of that. Uh, um, bloom technique, I don't think it's gonna work. Nope. But yeah, that's a bud ogre. The forest treasure chest gone mad. We can't trust anything anymore. Well, yeah, we can. We can trust normal treasure chests, I guess. Ooh, what's up there? It looks like the weird rock of really heavy transformed into one of those spirit globe thingies. Oh, I didn't mean to push it. Get back over here. Oh, except it doesn't have, like, the leaves floating around in it. It's just sort of empty, like a big plastic, like, gerbil ball you can push around. Okay, okay, oh, I'm not good with, I'm really bad at pushing things in this game. Even though I was pushing that cauliflower thing really well earlier until, like, I knocked it off the cliff. That was just an ex oh, okay. Oh, no. Let's take this calmly, come on, please, please. No. Okay, come on. I'm gonna... Oh, well, it's almost near my time limit. But... Oh, I got it. Okay, never mind. I was really discouraged. Oh, no, now it's stuck against a rock. Well, we can just slice that rock in half. Consumed grapes. Juicy fruit plucked from a vine fills astral pouch a little bit. Yeah, I told you, spirit globe of mean... You just roll on down there into that spot. Mm. Well, I think these weird statues there, I think they're a little creep-tastic. Just how they're all centered on there. I don't know what they're for. They're just really creepy. But if you, like, if you power slash them, you get, like, some money and stuff. And I really want to right now. Actually, I think I will. You get some stuff. Don't necessarily like know what those statues are. Could someone like tell me? Oh no! Oh, there's a secret. Sorry, my camera got out. That's the end of the episode, guys. Sorry. We'll try to get up there later. See you next time.